G'day traders, one minute mindset reset. Today, uh, talking about there's nothing random in the markets. Everything is measured and timed. Currencies, oil, gold, very specific, almost to the pip and to the minute. So I have developed setups over time, piecing things together, learning and bearing and, and eliminating out the garbage and all the other retail nonsense and furu nonsense. I love that term that Bao talks about, fur, furus, false gurus. And it's amazing how as much as retail thinks that they're doing all these other, you know, uh, non-retail concepts, smart money concepts, uh, whatever people want to call them, everything is very specific to time into measured moves if you're competing against an algorithm or against systematic quantitative hedge funds institutions central banks whoever's moving your market get very very specific and i'm not talking about you know talking about the high and the low i'm talking about the levels the measurements the timing how far has it moved not average daily range i'm talking about specific measured point to point movements during the day is it an up move a down move the day count is so critical because unless you understand the day count you don't understand if there's been false breaks you don't understand if they're trapping volume is it a short squeeze i mean resets three day counts the whole thing so as much as you know people want to dabble and mix things together and try different things that's great if you're trying to scalp pips but if you want to put size in the market, you need to understand that everything is measured and timed very specifically. The high and the low of the day. Those are very specific levels for measurements. So, you know, I just repeat a lot of the same concepts, but you have to get very specific about what you're looking for and have a level that you identify as an entry or a strike zone to time and enter the market whether it's the indexes, gold, oil, or the currencies. Whatever market you're trading, you better understand who you're trading against and how it works. But don't dabble. Dabbling is a recipe for dabbled results. If you want to run a trading business, get very specific. Understand that everything is very, very well designed. And the odds are against you if you're thinking in a retail mindset. So ask yourself this. Even though I'm trading smart money concepts, am I really trading what the quants, what the my opposition is actually doing? If not, I always ask myself, is this a, a trade that I can put size on? And if it is, which trade setup am I taking? Not, I'm at the high of the day, so I'm gonna sell it. Could be in a breakout of a measured move on a short squeeze, like oil today. Anyways, the more specific you get and understand that everything is exactly timed and measured, the bigger and better your results will be. Have a great week, traders. It's been a massive Monday on oil. So keep it simple, keep getting better. And if, by the way, go back and if you want to study resets, day one, day two, day three, reset on Thursday, day one, day two, day three, low, bull, uh, low bear candle, explosive move, measured move at the New York Open. Have a great day. I made the markets go with you.